chance to be rude to Hey them. kid, don't ever let them get inside your head They'll tell you what to do in life instead Of everything you know that you could get Don't let them guide your life towards regret I'll fight for what I love with every breath My past is filled with things I won't forget I use them all to push me to my best So treat the worst of times just like a test If only I could go back in time I'd tell myself that everything will end up alright Just push yourself, test yourself, figure out what you like and Find your limits, don't be rigid, always work towards a prime Surround yourself with open minds, people can change your life A few friends with intent can help you feel alive Find a passion, take some action, and with a little time Just be patient, make a statement, try to enjoy your life They'll try to kick you while you're down they want to rise up while you drown They want to fill your head with doubt They're silently scared that you'll figure it out I'll make it look like I'm losing Won't bother hiding my bruises And when they finally think you're wounded Then it's your chance to be ruthless I can see that they compare I think everyone's against me Maybe something in the air Am I paranoid? I swear a void is forming And they're scared I walk a straight path Not many can say that I like to play fast Cross me and there's payback You better pray that I don't see your face at Any place that I go I know you hate that I've been doing fine I'm not wasting any more time I live for the fight and the climb I think that the pain that's deep inside is what defines So I won't give up, I'm gonna make it to the top I don't care what's in my way, I swear I'm never gonna stop I could fall flat on my face and I swear I won't get back up Cause I don't deserve a thing and the road ahead is tough They'll try to kick you while you're down They wanna rise up while you drown they want to fill your head with doubt They're silently scared that you'll figure it out I'll make it look like I'm losing Won't bother hiding my bruises And when they finally think you're wounded Then it's your chance to be ruthless Welcome back to Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. How's everybody doing today? Hope everybody had a good Friday. Uh, let's see. Hey, Morgan. Hey, Val. Hey, Jin. Rave. Uh, who else we got here? Gamer. Mia. Glad you guys could make it. Let's see. Okay, let me make sure I got everything going on. Screen-wise and sound-wise. And I think we should be good to go. Okay. All right. Got it. All right. So, yeah, no co-op tonight, unfortunately, uh, because my brother has a regu another regular group he plays Celasta with, and I'm not a part of that group, unfortunately. So he's off to play, or will be off to play uh, Celasta with his weekly group tonight. Um, I'm just going to continue on with some Tears of the Kingdom because I'm currently like hooked on this game and oh, i need some coffee mm. right. yeah he doesn't like me tonight <laughs> okay yeah link rocking the hair showing yeah it's 
nice no, i i have the funny thing is i have the hair tie i have breath, the breath of the wild hair tie somewhere i just haven't used it but uh um no real plans tonight um uh, thinking i'm gonna take care of some some quests i've cleared so many quests like oh my god so many quests and um i'm thinking of doing maybe a few what i haven't done whatever i can find really to be quite honest and uh do some more exploration and maybe maybe even maybe another temple or at least poke at one who knows we'll see right now i've got to find uh what was i doing i, think I was i was looking for somebody disaster in gerudo canyon i found one of three people two are still lost in gerudo canyon so i thought this was gonna be i thought this was gonna be an easy one because I, I was supposed to be able to find their campsite somewhere and i just kind of want to knock this one out <sighs> but yeah i've been continuing to play this on and off off stream as you can see i've been charging along doing a lot of exploration a lot of uh armor find oh that's another thing i should there's under there's on there's depth coliseums i have i have yet to do uh, uh good question is where are these two guys around i've got two people i gotta locate and i have no idea where to even begin i think i've been doing a pretty damn good job too because i'm trying not to look up anything i've had i'm not gonna lie i've had to look up a few things but um i think i'll be honest i think uh ooh, cave I realize this was a cave i I'm, i've been thinking tales of the kingdom has so far been in my opinion a bit easier than breath of the wild has been i don't know if it's because i'm also used used to the breath of the wild gameplay which is a possibility but i i feel like they might have gone a little easier on on things like the like the shrines yeah I, I i think it's easier like the shrines i now i i there have been a few shrines that that did make me scratch my head for quite a bit um but nothing nothing along the lines because i i remember a few shrines in breath of the wild that really had my head scratching oh hi that was freaking easy and quick Boop. But yeah, I, I, I haven't had nearly as much difficulty in TOTK. I think part of it has to... Well, not only the design. I think they did go a little easier. But um, part of it is also the building, which is fun as hell. But the ability to, the ability to build really opened up possibilities, like different possibilities in solving some of the puzzles to the point of where... I think it made some puzzles just super easy to really just punch through. The hell is that? Oh, that's a tumbleweed. Hey, Jay, how you doing? Now, I'm not trying to to toot my own horn like, oh, I'm some great freaking Legend of Zelda player. I, I, I am. I am not great. But yeah, it definitely seems like it's a bit easier. I was a little apprehensive with some of the new monsters, but once you get to learn your way around some of these, even the tougher monsters, they get pretty easy as long as you're prepared. Prepar preparation seems to be the big key. What is that? Oh, I've been there before. Never mind. Actually, what is over there? Oh, I came across, I think, one of the people I need to find. Batteries, portable pots, springs, big wheels, and stakes. Grab some more of those. Or no, never mind. I thought there was a okay. You're messing around with Jurassic Park Evolution 2, Jay. I never played any of the draw. I, I did get one of the Jurassic Park uh games. Thank you to I think it was Jin who gave me a code for it. Uh, it was either Jin, me, or a gamer. One of the two one of the three. I still have yet to futz around with it. Uh, what happens if I put an apple in here? I completely missed. 
I know it was one of, one of the three of you. <laughs> Thank you very much, by the way. Let's try this again. I just haven't... I haven't touched it yet. Nothing? Nothing. Really? Wait, oh, well, hold on. That is... Well, what happens if I put bananas there? You know what? I hadn't thought about that. I've been putting apples in a lot of these. I hadn't thought to put bananas in there. I don't know why I didn't think to put bananas in there, but we'll see. Nothing. Okay. Well, screw you. I really thought I would have found one of the campers. I still need to find two of them. <sighs> okay. So we're still looking. Not sure where yet. Please don't rain when I get here. Let's see. I might grab some of this stuff while I'm here. Like I'm here already anyway. Is there anything down there? Can't tell. Let's drop five in there. I may be a little winded today, too. I, I just... Oh, I see a blood moon. Hold on. I had another early day today, even though I stayed up late playing uh, Celasta with my brother. Woohoo! I love the sound of being able to pick up a crap load of shit. Uh, but I busy day today topped off with one of my neighbors needing assistance. They had to, they just got AT&T, uh, excuse me, AT&T fiber and got their router. And for some odd reason they've placed now I like AT&T, uh, admittedly. Um, now I don't have AT&T where I'm at now. But where I've had AT&T, they've been pretty good in terms of service with their internet and whatnot. I actually still have them for my mobile uh, phone. But she got sent this router and everything, and uh, she's a senior, so she's got a lot of the a lot of the free stuff that she gets from being on Medicare and whatnot. And um, they sent her the AT and T sent her the router, but everything in terms of putting everything together is like done electronically. Like I couldn't find any paperwork or anything. So I'm like, how do they expect like them to put like a senior who's you know doesn't isn't really computer savvy at all? How do they expect them to put this stuff together? Now I understand that they can call, but I understand how confusing it could be. So I spent like a good long while trying to get her internet freaking worked up and set up so she can watch TV and Netflix and Hulu and stuff like that. Still a better experience than Comcast. Still a much better experience than Comcast though. Uh, do we go up there? I forgot if I've been up there or not. Yeah, well, you, pl you plug it in and then... It's supposed to be done remotely, but then for some odd reason that failed. And um, so then had to call. And then I got the one dude that if it wasn't for the fact that I was there, I felt so, so she never would have been able to freaking follow her, his directions. And I, I don't mean I don't mean to make her sound like she's completely ignorant of how to how to set things up but she's she's of the older generation she is a senior she's this is stuff that she, she just she doesn't know doesn't understand and i completely understand that but the nice the nice thing though no you you know what i like i said i like at t better than comcast i when I've dealt with them, they treated me a hell of a lot better. I got things done quicker, and they generally bent over backwards to help me out. Well, at least where where I was at. 
where I was at, they they did a damn good job. I had nothing but good interactions with AT&T. Comcast stresses me out if I have to look for their freaking phone number to call them. Good Lord. I get stressed out just, just knowing that I might have to call them for an issue. That's how bad it is with Comcast. I test Comcast. But there's the only way I'm going to get the fastest speed that I can for my internet. So I kind of have to bite the freaking bullet. Yeah, and, but otherwise, yeah, AT&T has been nothing but good to me. And they were pretty good. It's just the one guy. And he wasn't horrible, but it's just the instructions, the, the, what he was trying to get done and what he was going to have her do. If it wasn't for the fact that I was there, she was going to be, she would have been lost. <laughs> but the... Oh, the cool thing though was, and I was just joking because she was, because I set her, I set her, her internet up or her router up, plugged everything in. And like I said, she's got fiber now and she was given a free tablet uh, and she had a TV that she wanted, that she needed set up because she had Netflix and Hulu. She just, she would watch this stuff on her phone. I don't understand how she didn't like, I mean, she has a hard enough time seeing as it is. And so I got her TV connected and her account set up with Netflix, which I had to. She didn't know her passwords. I actually had to freaking crack her shit to get her passwords and stuff. Um, but I did that uh, for her for a TV and her tablet and got her phone attached to the Internet. So she's not using data on her phone. But it was hilarious because uh, she's, you know, thank you, thank you, thank you. And I'm just joking around. She's like, what do I owe you? What do I owe you? And it's like, I'm not going to I'm not going to ask her for money or anything like that. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It's like, no, what do you want? What do I owe you? I, I got to get you something. I'm like, New York strip steaks. We're good. <laughs> you know, really just joking. I, I ordered dinner tonight. I got I got some ribs and stuff like because I ordered out. I was going to be lazy today because it's been a busy day. So I ordered dinner, got some ribs. And I uh, just got the ribs delivered. I'm, I'm unpacking everything, getting ready to eat. I hear a knock at the door, and it's the neighbor that I just helped. She comes up, and she hands me two grocery bags. And she had gotten me, was it strawberry or raspberry? I'll have to look again. Strawberry or raspberry uh, lemonade. Uh, like a big thing of it. Um, mashed potatoes. Some beef tips in gravy and two New York strip steaks. Like, holy crap. <laughs> like, it surprised the crap out of me. Yeah, it was sweet as hell. She, and I didn't have to do that, but it was sweet. And I, what am I, gonna, I can't say no. She got me steaks. I'm not going to say no. <laughs> So I have dinner for tomorrow. <laughs> Get some New York strip steaks done. Some mashed taters. Oh, the weekend is set. Oh, there's another cave over here. Oh, maybe I'll find one of the two, one of the three people or one of the two people left that I got to find in here. But that that's been my day. Uh, other than dealing with a few things at work and then that. So not not ter not too bad. Just just busy. Out there fire! Hey Schnuckle. But uh, yeah, like but it paid off. I mean I got I got some New York strips. I got uh oh, there's the guy. Got to help a neighbor out, which I feel good about. Just what is making that noise? Oh! Hello! There you are. Gotcha. Almost fell, <laughs> fell on the dude. Okay, I'll be with you in just a moment, dude. Let me... Let me... Ooh, this a shield? Oh, it's a rusty shield. I don't care. Well, I might grab that anyway. I wanted to burn the crap out of this. I forgot to sell those bloom plants. I've got... I've got uh, like 999. I can't carry anymore. They're just sitting up there taking up, you know, not doing a damn thing. Is that, are those going to go away? 
How long will those take to burn? Hey, Oppress Alpha, how you doing? So, let that be a lesson to you. Help out your neighbors. Be a good neighbor, especially to the, to you know, to the elderly if they need it, if they need assistance. Because you never know. You could end up with stakes. <laughs> you never know. And even if you don't end up with stakes, help them out anyway. Royal shield. Now there's a shield I don't mind having. The only problem is, is I have jack shit for room. <sighs> and the funny thing is I also spent a ton to just, well, I, that, that might be back there. Even if I don't get it now, how many, how many freaking, hold on. Where do I find it? That's, that's not what I'm looking for. How, how many that's in here? Korok seats 20. And I know I'm going to need more than 20. I forgot how, how many more I'm going to need to get a new shield slot. Uh, are you feeling okay? Press alpha. Just out of curiosity. You're starting to worry me a little bit. Almost. Ah, slid down. Let's grab this. There you go. Kimmy. Okay. Let's talk to you. Get you done. We're going to find one more. Big laser. Oh, I guess I'm not done with these guys. Easy peasy. As soon as I hit the right freaking thing. Nope. 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 Maybe. There you are. Oh, wow. I'm running out of these. I probably should, should have used a choo choo. Nope. Yeah. I, nope. Do I have any white choo choo jelly? Who's it? Sure. I do. Yep. I don't have to aim. Toast. Are you good now? <laughs> uh, might think I'm a hopeless coward and you wouldn't be entirely wrong, but I'm also... What? <laughs> hopeless coward bodyguard. Okay. And then he throws up. Oh. How much are you going to pay me not to tell anyone? I'm going to tell everyone. All right. So we got one. Wait a second. Have I been there before? I had to have been over there before. That's like almost painfully obvious. I have not been there before. Are you kidding me? That's like one of the most obvious caves I've seen yet. And I haven't been there. Well, this will be easy enough. At least I'll get this one done. I'll see about some coliseums, maybe. Oh, go. You know, eat a dick. I don't have that many bombs. Let's go back to the jellies. Oh. Boop. Oh, really? <laughs> I forgot I had these. Freaking time bombs. Did I get the other one? Oh, no, I didn't. Oh, oh I freaking aimed at the wrong dude. Oh, that's why I didn't see him. He's breathing fire. Asshole. Oh, you die. Die now. Oh, I didn't even know there were three of them. And there went that weapon. Let's use you, except I'm going to stick. What am I going to stick on you? I'm going to stick something on you. That. Die, bitch. Ow. 
As you can see, I've been spending a lot of time farming a whole lot of shite. <coughs> Let's take care of these guys, hopefully in one shot. Yep. Ah, okay, two shots. Okay, Mia, you know I was going to ask, so how far are you at now? How far have you gotten? I know you're playing. That. That. What the hell was that? Really? Ow. Do I have anything else I can use to break these things? Was I that close? I fucking hate using a fairy by accident. That was dumb. Wow, I need new food. Yeah, go away. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, wait a second. There's gotta be something else in here. Oh, there it is. Get up there. You just wait hold on a second you just oh 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 i know what you mean the the statue the 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 whatchamacallit like the polar opposite of the goddess statue that was if i remember correctly that's also where you get if, if you're if you run around and search you get the full you gotta run around there quite a bit, but you can get the soldier's armor and stuff in there. The horny statue. <laughs> I saw your face. Gotcha. Am I that low on freaking arrows already? How many arrows do I got? Holy shit. I need to go shopping. Oh, there's gotta be something up in here. All right, let's try this. It's just a weird protrusion. I really gotta get gotta get more bombs. So there's some caves in here that if you don't have a metric buttload of freaking bombs, like I remember using like half my weapons. Like I lost half my weapons breaking rocks in in like a couple of these caves like a ridiculous amount of weapons just breaking rocks better run i'm turning, I'm turning you into meat i'm like turning you to meat anyway ah, i missed Ooh, good meat come here i'm asian i eat dog come here oh no he done he done left left, left off the cliff Uh, I don't care about those things. Well, I might. I see a treasure chest up there. I am really running out of freaking everything. That's water. That's nothing. My 
choo-choo stuff go? There you are. No, just use the fruit. Easy. What's up in here? Ten arrows! Woohoo! Okay, I still got a cave to find. It's maybe it's around it's gotta be around here somewhere. So I've got one more of those guys to find. And there's smoke. Maybe that's it. Is there anything in that direction? Nope. Oh, if I had a dollar for every time I exploded myself in this game. You think it'd be a fa you think exploding myself was a favorite pastime. Oh, I see someone. Yeah, scavenge this area real quick. Oh, no. Have I been here? Okay, that's the other guy. Oh, he needed a splash fruit. I don't think I had one at the time. That might be all three of them. Okay, bye. And now I gotta go back turn this in and then maybe let's I'll do some exploration down to the depths where nobody apparently enjoys going I know Caboose doesn't like the depths I don't mind it it's just I just find it annoying I actually wish there was more stuff to fly around with uh now there is a lot of stuff to find in the sky I just wish there was actually a little bit more because I enjoy for someone that doesn't like heights like me, I actually enjoyed the sky, the sky portion quite a bit. Especially since I have this armor and I don't have to worry about freaking falling to my death. Speaking of which. Anything here? I think that I, I made some of that stuff that makes you glow in the dark. Um, it's okay. I just don't think it was as handy as I would have liked it, liked it to be. Because it does make it glow around you, which is great. But then if you're trying to look farther away, you're still using bloom seeds all over the place. In fact, I've, I've still got to sell, and it, not that they're hard to get. I've got to sell half my bloom seeds, make some money off this stuff. Cause I can't even pick any more up. Uh, is that you? Hey. Uh, no, I already took that test. Obviously you guys, why is the dot? Oh no, maybe. Yep. Yeah, you guys. I drained most of my coffee. Oh, <gasps> yes. 10 bomb. Oh, that was definitely worth it. Even though I need to go buy more. I need to buy more arrows. Complete. Okay, so I'm going to go buy some more. I'm going to, I'm prepping for that ah, freaking map. Let's buy more arrows and bombs over here 10 bombs is freaking nice <clears throat> but i also completely forgot that i have time bombs which i 
I honestly didn't use a single time bomb until earlier today because I was looking through my stuff because I, I was running out of bombs. I'm like, what else can I use? And I realized I had like over a hundred time bombs and I never used a single one. There have been so many things that would have been a lot easier for me had I realized and remembered I could use those. Because those are really easy to get if you have uh, one of those dispensers. Uh, if you find dispensers that give uh, that gives you bombs. Like I said, I had over a hundred of them and didn't think about them. Completely forgot about them. The only thing is obviously they're time bombs, so they don't explode on, on impact, so. I buy arrows because I toss them like candy. Like I will machine gun the crap out of something as I'm doing like that bullet time stuff. Actually, you know what? I could use more dazzle fruit. Oh yeah, I machine gun the shit out of stuff. And I don't always I mean I usually depends on where I go. There are some places where I where I've been where I've gotten up to like I end up with like 300 arrows. And then I'll use all 300 annihilating a bunch of crap. Here to sell. Where is all my Well, actually I you know what just occurred to me. Well even Oh yes. Oh, they're all they're two a piece. So if I sell half of those, because <laughs> these things are so easy to get, they're everywhere. This is one of those things that you, you it's almost impossible to run out of unless you sell them all. I want to sell half. That's a thousand rupees right there. I mean, anytime you see you see one of them, you, you're getting like usually two to three. And there went my weapon. Free arrow. Am I, am I stealing his stock? I'm probably stealing his stock, which is hilarious. I need. Uh, let's use that. Two extra arrows. Yeah, but I'm always buying arrows from like Beetle and the other shops and all that other stuff. I also miss a lot. <laughs> uh, okay, what was I gonna do? Oh yeah, let me let me check the house real quick. If there's any weapons I can nip. Oh, you know what? I'm going down the depths. I'll probably find some weapons down there. <laughs> um. Yeah, I know. What was in that box? I do break boxes every chance I get, but a lot of times I, I've been really lucky and found like a billion arrows and then I've broken like a crap load of boxes and gotten like five. Did I go here? That looks that's the scorching Coliseum. Have I been there? I can't remember if I've been there. I know there's a few Coliseums. I, I did the Coliseum with all the Lynels. That's... Have I done the forest one? I can't remember what Coliseums I've done. The only one that I remember doing is the Floating Coliseum, because that's the one that, ha that has, your, has you fighting five Lynels in a row. And I know I've done at least two others, but I can't remember which ones I've done. All right, you know what? The only thing I can do is hit... Let me hit these two. If I've done them already, then I won't get anything new, obviously, but if I have it, then I'll get some new armor or something. We'll see. I'm actually I've done I've done quite a lot of the quests. I know I haven't touched on uh 
Well, I, I've, I've run around uh, the Goron area, but I know I haven't gotten every quest from there, and I haven't even touched on the Zora area. So I'm sure there's going to be a lot of side quests there, but I'm at the point where I'm starting to gear up and I'm getting ready for endgame. I think. But I've been gearing up pretty big. You notice I started stacking shields on shields. Because I found out that that was pretty handy on getting shields to last. And I need to pop out some people. You and give me you. All right. Guess I need to walk around. You know what? I don't know if I did do this Coliseum because I don't remember running around in this area to do it. Very possible I never did. Oh, you freaking making that noise. I thought one of those. I thought the arms were chasing me. What is this? Oh, nothing. I thought the arms were chasing me there for a second. And if I have to get some decent weapons, I can go to a bargainer statue down here. I've got enough pose. I've got enough pose, I can get some pretty good stuff. Why did I pick that up? Where's that Coliseum? I'm going the wrong freaking way. Bomb flowers. Shiza. Go away. Dizzy. Ow. Douche. All that. Ooh, give me that. And that. And that. And definitely that. Let's prep some weapons. I'm going to stick... Yep. Uh, I'm gonna put on you. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Yep. Wrong button. Attach that to you. That's 37. Not very strong. What can I attach to you? Uh, maybe we can do bone on bone and see how devastating that can be. I I freaking annihilated a bunch of Maldugas. Because I found out that their freaking attack, their fuse attack power is crazy. Same with the uh, horrible horns. Take that one, use you to that. 60. Not bad. Except that one, and what am I going to stick on you? Yeah, why not? 39. Not as good as I'd hoped. Yeah. Good enough. I still need a crap load of Zonite. Where the frick is the... Oh, found it. That's the Coliseum. Give me that. I don't think I've done this one. I might have, but I don't think I did. I don't see a chest. Maybe I did do it. There should be a chest over there if I didn't. probably did do this one, but now I'm curious as to what this one was. Yeah, no chest. Wait. I don't remember doing this. Oh, wait. Yep. Nope. Yep, I did. Defeat. Ow, my face. Holy shit. The fuck was that? I did do this one. What the fuck did I get from this? Oh, I'm using the wrong gear. 
Yep. Actually, no, no. <laughs> Yep, run! I don't have that many arrows. Out of my way! Oh, thank you! Oh, wow, that did a whole lot. You guys take care of him for me. Turn around, turn around. Thank you. Gotcha. Hey, Simon, how you doing? Oh, come on. Ah! Eh. Eh. What the hell? What did I get from this Coliseum? Why don't I remember fighting these guys? <laughs> Give me all that. Ooh, large crystallized charge. Nice. Oh, I don't have to do a whole thing. Okay. Okay, let's check another Coliseum. I'm guessing I did these because they show up and that I've seen them. Um. Where was the other Coliseum? This one, Scorching Coliseum, which I'm going to have to change for. Because otherwise I will melt. Like that. And then we are going to go... We're going to peek at this one and see if I did it. I might not do this one over again. I want to see if I can find some new ones. Simon is a good brother, yes. Not enough you not enough you, uh not enough Simons in the world. I am not saying that jokingly. Need more brothers like that. Ooh. Get that. Oh, yeah, I've gotten that already. Okay, so here's the other Coliseum. I'm guessing I did this one before. How do we get in this freaking Coliseum? Where's the entrance? Oh, damn it. My bow burned up. Whoops. Probably should have paid attention to that. Give me that one. That was a waste of a bow. Where's the door? I could just climb this fucker. I'll just climb it. I know there's probably an entrance somewhere here. Oh, I see where the entrance is. <laughs> I just saw it in my mini map. Eh, who needs an entrance when I can just climb over? Let's see if there is a chest. There is no chest. Okay, so I've done this before. I'm not keen on doing it over again. Let's see if there's a Coliseum I haven't been to. So that's three Coliseums. There's something there, but I don't think that's a Coliseum. I don't know what that is. Honestly, don't know what that is. I don't think it's a Coliseum, though. It looks like it could be. How big are the Colosseums on the map? Trying to... Oh, wait, no, that's not a Colosseum. I know what that is. It's probably uh, kind of like an arena. Not a Colosseum, but could be a one of the boss. It could be one of the bosses I fought previously. Because uh, the Colosseums have those things around the edges. This looks like it could be a Colosseum. I don't think I've been there. It's not giving me a name, so I think I'm going to head there. Let's do that one. Straight to the east. Let's see, is there another way down there? I don't have to travel so far. 
right under Fort Hatino, Hatano, whatever. All right, we're going there. Hey, yeah, Alan. Did YouTube go down? As far as I know, my stream's going well. R try refreshing your 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 browser, Simon. If you can hear me. <sighs> Welcome back. Okay, so I'm going straight that aways. And how you doing, Alan? Good to see you. So what do you guys think of the Celasta? Honest opinion. I I was having a ooh, I was having a blast. But then again, I love D and D. I miss being around my friends uh, at a table with paper and pen, rolling the dice, and uh This is the closest I can get to it. I mean I'll take it. Okay, we got an armored Lionel here. I think we're gonna try and beat the shit out of it but I'm going to save uh, I know I don't talk as often as I do uh, with other games with like like in Celasta but there's a lot of talking involved when it comes to mentioning actions or what you're planning on doing um, I can use my good one got a decent shield uh, he's armored. So. Trying to think of what weapon to use. I'm going to have to break his armor. I'll just go with, yeah, I'll just go with what I've got. Actually, is it hot? Am I wearing this for no reason whatsoever? I'm wearing this for no reason whatsoever. Let's put on... That. And then we're gonna go say hi. So let's save again so I don't have to redo all this in case I die. Oops. Yeah, Celesta is a great intro to DD. Freaking but I'm a I'm a big time I mean when it first came out, D D player at heart. Bastard. Oh, Jesus Christ, son of a... Ah! Ow. Really? All right. Nope. Ow! There went my shield. Eat a dick. Oh, busted his armor. Yeehaw! Right up, cowboy. Okay, I need a new shield. Did he seriously bust my shield? Oh, no, he didn't. Oh, he, oh no, he broke the thing that was on the outside of my shield. You dick. How dare you? All right, get that way. What's with that? Ah! What is on the ground? What is on the ground? What is on the ground? I want it. Ah. Ow! Ow! Got it. Whatever it was, I'm going to eat some food. Ah, uh, you. Thank you. Running! Hey, it's a grain. How you doing? Hey, fucker. No, oh, fuck. Really? He broke this. God damn. Oh, ho, ho, ho. douchebag was in my way. I couldn't see shit. Why do you keep yelling? Holy crap. The fuck was that? Ow. Might have jumped the wrong direction. Oh, come on. My timing is horrible. I should probably equip another shield. Uh, let's see. 48. 44. 
to you. Oh! Ow! <laughs> my face! All of my face! What is with the explosions? Why? Why? Alright. Eh, out of my way! Can't see shit! Oh, come on! Oh, bad timing. Oh, yes! <laughs> I should probably be using a stronger weapon. I only... I was only supposed to use that until his armor broke. second time to test out a theory you you and you and you <laughs> let's see if this works ah! I'm gonna need I'm gonna need to eat food though because I I do not have a lot of hearts Let's see how this works. I'm curious about this. Fucker. Oh! Uh, why? Oh, 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 get him, get him, get him. Oh, did I just, oh no! Oh God, are they racing over here? You son of a bitch. They are. Great, now I've got to deal with this Lionel and the fucking douchebags on horses. Ow! Ass! Great. Whoa! Thank you! Get up on there! I would have thought this was going to do more damage, but... Why have anything that increases damage? Anything that increases damage would be delicious right now. I have nothing. I... Well, I can... I can tough myself up, I guess. All right, fine. No! I missed. Woo! Ow! Hey! hey, Blue! How are you doing? Hey, fucker. No! Hey Whoa! Miss me! I missed too. Oh, no flurry. Ow! Okay, uh, well, that did it break? No, I still got it. No! Ow! Oh, shit. My timing is horrible. Ow, my face. Wow, I'm gonna use up all my food. I've got... I don't have that much luck. Ah, ah, ooh, get him. Yeah. Oh, well, that one fucking broke already. Uh... Eeny, meeny, miny, mo catch a tiger by the... I don't want to use my best stuff yet. Because... Well, it's good stuff. Oh, he dead. He dead. He all dead. I don't know if that... Did as much damage as I thought it was going to do. Oh, what is that? Oh, touch it. Actually, I'm going to take a photo of it. White maned Lionel Saber Horn. Hello. Uh, anything else I haven't taken a photo of? Mace Horn. I got those already, but I didn't take a photo of it. I forgot all about this picture taking shit. Royal Claymore. Okay. Oh, 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 stop it. Stop posing. Give me all the things. Yay. Ooh, a savage Lionel bow. What'd you. What? No bonus to it. Oh well. Okay, let's. 
change my outfit because that's ridiculous. And I'm going to... Oh, no, I'm not going to eat food because I can go somewhere and believe whatever the hell's going on with my face. Uh, I've got that, that, and that. I just have to get to over there. Oh, shit. I might have to eat the food. You know what? No. Let's go back here. Let's heal up. It's not that far. Have I tried making the 800 damage weapon yet? No, I have not tried. I think I know what you're talking about. It's actually the Zora weapons, if I remember correctly. Is it not? You got the Zora weapon. You fuse. If I remember correctly, okay. You get a Zora weapon. You wear the bone. You wear that bone armor I was just wearing before. And then you attach a, Muldu a Mulduga jaw to it because the bone armor increases the damage of the Mulduga jaw. You get the power that makes yourself wet all the time. Basically, you make yourself moist all the time. And then you eat some, like, freaking attack up food. And uh, you only fight at 3 o'clock on a Sunday afternoon while it's sunny outside and you're sopping wet and all this other weird shit. <laughs> Yes, well, the thing is, is because um, Zora weapons, actually, their damage increases when they're wet. So basically, if you continue to make yourself wet, you do a lot of damage. I, 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 I can completely, uh, how do I say? I've experienced that. Uh, I'm not going to go into detail because my daughter's in the channel. <laughs> uh, okay, where am I going? I'm going this way. I'm stepping in all the shit. Stop stepping in shit. I need to ride this guy. Oh, did you break all your stuff already? God damn. Okay, hold on. I've got to give give him more stuff. Uh, question is, what am I going to give him? I've got a lot of stuff, so... Let's use one of those. Really? I only have... I thought I had more of those cannons. That and... No... Yes. That and that. Come here. I'm gonna equip you with that on the right hand and that on the left hand. <laughs> and then we're good. Oh wait, I need to ride this guy anyway. Much crap around here. Oh, I'm gonna shoot it. Don't you dare alert your buddies. I will shoot you in the face. Am I going the right way? Kinda, not really. Run! Binga Grove. I been here? Probably something mean and nasty to jump out at me. <gasps> Ooh. I wonder if this will give me a pristine weapon. Hold on, gotta check something. What do you have for me? Soldier spear. Ooh, okay. I think I have a piece of shit I can drop. Do I not? Yes, I can just drop this one. It's going to break anyway. I don't care. Give me that. Thank you. Nice. So, what am I going to stick on you? Let's put... Preferably something uber strong. Something that'll be extremely painful for whatever the hell I'm fighting. No. No. That's gonna look badass, but no. Ah! That's a maybe. Oh, wait. What am I. There we go. No. What happened to. Damn it. I'd have passed it up. 
Not that one. I had a coal in one of these Gleok things. There you are. Don't! Oh! Wrong one. Okay, that. And then we are going to put this one, and I'm going to stick something else on this guy. No. Sure, why not? All right. That's 43. That's a 40. 39. Using you. Okay, back on track. Let's get this. Where am I going? I'm running the wrong direction again. Wait a second. God damn it. My left. Which is that away. This better be the right way. Kinda. Trying to find this freaking Coliseum. I can't recall if I've been there or not yet. What are you? You're big. Oh, that's a Hinox. Holy crap, that's a river of bleh. Okay, and he's in my way. Hey, Simon, I've been curious about it. I'm debating it. Um, I don't intend to pre-order it. Only because I've been burned on shit in the past. Um, I haven't seen that much on it to really i mean what i've seen looks pretty i'll just put it at that but i don't know if that's enough for me to want to pre-order it yet kind of kind of want to check it out first i'm sure there'll be i mean there's a possibility i could still pre-order it but that depends on what like early reviewers state stuff like that and when i say pre-order that's like probably pre-order like a day before it goes live You're going to you're going to wait for the PC version. I get that. Actually, I just downloaded a game uh that uh, I don't know, maybe I'll maybe I'll do a stream of it next week. Um I used to play a lot of these games. Hey. Uh, oh, you're saying hi to Scrappy, never mind. Oh, you're saying hi to somebody else. Um, uh, it's a, it's, it's a, like a type of game that I haven't played in a long time, but me and my brother used to play a ton of, uh, during our early video game, dur during our video game infancy. Um, but what was it? Hold on. I got to look, I'm going to pause real quick while I look up the game I'm talking about. It just recent it just recently came out. Uh yeah, just recently came out PlayStation Plus. So maybe I'll do a stream of it. Um NBA 2K23 just recently came out and it's looking really <laughs> Actually I did download it, but I know I'm I'm kidding about streaming a, a sports game. Um The funny thing is I actually used to play sports game a lot of sports games. Um when I first played, uh, started playing video games. Yeah, it's, 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 uh, it's a freebie now. I did download it. I'm just, I'm just joking about, ah, ow! I was just joking about streaming it. Ah, why? Two silvers, like on my face. I was talking. Why am I climbing a tree? Run! What? Wait, what am I armed with? Oh, that's shit. Ow! God damn it, I'm supposed to go in an arena. You guys being jackasses. No, stop it. Oh, is he still around? Where is he? I didn't even realize I walked right by this thing. How about you just... Oh, did you just really throw a rock at me? Hold on. We will continue this conversation. Un momento. I don't care. You just go away. Okay, are we clear? Ooh, Zonite. 
Okay, that might have been worth it. Um, <coughs> what was I saying? <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, yeah. I used to play used to play sports games all the time. Um, in fact, one of my favorites. Uh, I played a lot of this. Or actually, I should say two of my favorites. Me and my brother used to play. I can't remember the name or the exact name. But it was a hockey game. I'm pretty sure it was on Nintendo. Like it was ice hockey or I don't know if that was the exact name. If it was called ice hockey. It might have been a different game. But they were like little pudgy, you had little pudgy guys, little normal size, like normal size guys, little pudgy guys or little skinny guys. And it was an ice hockey game that was just fun as hell. Um, no official teams that I'm aware of, just, you know crappy graphics but it, it was fun uh it, it was a lot of good fun that's so nice uh that and uh what was the other one sports game that we would play all the time tecmo bowl that well i don't know if my brother played it all the time but i i played the crap out of that game a lot of people i knew played the crap out of tecmo bowl Oh, I completely bypassed this freaking arena. It is that way. I knew a lot of people that love that game. Tecmo Bowl. Um, and it was a football game. And you had playbooks. And all that stuff. Um, you had you had like I don't know if they were accurate well, they're kind of accurate city team or you know state teams and stuff but that was another one that regardless of whether you like sports or not it was just fun we even ran like me and friends just we ran tournaments and stuff like that uh oh okay i haven't done this one i have not done this let's just eat some regular food or whatever what have you uh, good enough. Do I have any sunlines? Well, if I eat a sunlion, will that get rid of my that weird shit? I don't know if it'll get rid of it if I just eat it straight. I never tried eating it straight, so no, I can't even eat it. Just hold it. I've got to cook with it. The funny thing is, that's the only football game I've ever played was Tecmo Bowl. Normally, I wasn't into sports games, but Tecmo Bowl and ice hockey were like the shit. Blood Bowl, um, I've always wanted to try because that looked fun as hell. I never played it, but I've always wanted to try it. <laughs> Isn't that the truth, Blue? Like, you're in the middle of a fight, you're about to die, and you just start stuffing meat in your face hole. I'm just... Uh, actually, you know what? Before I start this fight, can I see what I'm fighting? I can see what I'm fighting! Oh, ew. Whole lot of Lazalfos? Oh, this is not gonna be fun. I do not like fighting Lazalfos. They're... Lazalfos are squirrely as shit. I hate that they bounce around and stuff. I don't like finding these guys, but I do not have whatever is in here. So we are going to do this. A uh, good question is what am I going to use? It's better if I have something like a spear. So this show actually, what, what do I have on a thunder Gleok spear? Okay. That could be coming in handy. Going to start with this though. What is that? Silver Lionel blade. Hmm. I prefer to use something quick when I'm fighting Lazalfos. And I, I prefer to use a spear when I'm fighting Lazalfos, I should say. And ice. Ice helps too. But yeah, I hear Blood Bowl is super fun. And it's 40k. <laughs> what not 40k? It's uh Warhammer Fantasy. What am I why am I I'm not I don't want to throw that. It's Warhammer Fantasy, which is just even better. And 
I because I've seen people play it. The cheerleaders are freaking hilarious in that game. They're freaking amazingly hilarious. I got a new shield. I will stick something to you later. Like the cheerleaders are like, are probably like uh, <coughs> half the reason to get the game. Just because they're so stupid funny. All right, uh, I need to grab whatever's on the ground before I lose some of it. That all just happened. <laughs> oh. miss I missed this stuff right up the butt gotcha <laughs> oh, what a dick give me that that and no yes thank you What else is what's the, what else is in no nope. can't pick up any more weapons the glia corn that i'm using is almost like a freaking cheat code freeze and smack okay now one of each and if you're fighting a fire breath lazalfos one freaking poke in their toast Yeah, that. Oh, oh, oh! So didn't freaking hit that fast enough. Yeah. Oh, I missed. Yeah, the Gleok horn and a spear, it's just stupid easy. Even if it doesn't do a whole lot of damage. Really? I never got one of those before? Oh. Yep. What I get? <gasps> I got Ravio's hood! Which is like, probably utter useless, other than it looks goofy as hell. I, well, okay, I, if I remember correctly, this only... What does this do? The hood of a traveling merchant who had a bracelet that could turn the wearer into a painting. Wearing it increases your sideways climbing speed. Okay, yeah, that's all it does. Is it increases your sideways climbing. Doesn't does it increase your climbing up or down. It does look good, though. We'll give it that. It, it doesn't increase your up and down. It just increases how fast you climb sideways. But it is cool looking. <laughs> oh, the ears wiggle. Even better. It's got an ear wiggle. Oh, wait, I got to see what happens when I'm running full tilt. That's not full tilt. Okay, I was kind of hoping they would, like, lay flat back. But they still wiggle, so that's not bad. I was really hoping for, like, a, a, a laid flat back against my head thing when I was running. I'll take it. Okay, so that's another... Did I break anything? No, I didn't. Uh, that... I don't think there's any chests up here either. Take a peek, but I doubt it. It's usually one chest in here, and then that's it. Uh, okay. So, we did... Like I said, we did the floating coliseum. I've done that. I've done... The Forest Coliseum. I've done the Scorching Coliseum. Just did... Which one was that one? The Secluded Coliseum. There should be... I don't know if there's another Coliseum or not. 
Uh, there's Kariko Village. That's not in the shape of a Coliseum. Uh, did I fight whatever was in there? I, I don't know if I can get in there. Marquet Island. It's not a Coliseum. But there might be something interesting in there. Hold on, let me change my gear. Let's take a peek at that. Because there might be something in Where was it? There might be something interesting there to poke. There you are. Marque Island. Go fall down that hole. Hey, a Jolin! Where's Jolin? There you are, Jolin. Man, giant mugs of coffee do not last long around me. Mm. And I actually got chocolate. Got some. Got some uh, Dove dark chocolate. Dove milk chocolate and dark chocolate. Those just those little squares are like the only chocolate I really like. There's well, no, there's others, but when it comes to like, like I don't like Hershey chocolate bars. They taste weird to me. North. The dove chocolates, I think, taste fantastic. I don't know, something about the Hershey, just like, when I, and why do I mean the Hershey bars? I'm just talking about, like, the straight Hershey, Hershey chocolate bars have just a weird taste to me. I'm sure I liked it when I was a kid, but I don't know. Something changed in either in me or in it. Let's put on that. Down I go. What, sour milk? Hold on. Let's also start dropping a crap load of these. <coughs> oh, sniffles. Allergies are kicking my ass. Another reason why I use a lot of arrows is because I do weird shit like this. Oh, really expected there to be like something big. It's not. Thought I was gonna drop on like uh, a mini. Oh, hello. You. Okay. Oh yeah, there was a freaking shrine, so there should have been a light. That makes sense. Let's grab the light route. Make it easier in case whatever's down here kicks my ass. That's what Hershey bars. To, uh, yeah, milk chocolate. I don't know what it is. I just something in it changed, and I don't like it. Milk the the Dove milk chocolate. Those little Dove milk chocolate squares are freaking for me. That's where it's at. Those are delicious. And I even like the, like, right now, I've got a dark chocolate. Their dark chocolate's not bad. Oh, sports games haven't been good in a long while. Ah, uh, I was never a big sports game person. Like I said, the only sports games that I really enjoyed were Tecmo Bowl and uh, that ice hockey game. A lot of them got into the management stuff and all this other stuff and the stats and got really deep and... It was hard for me to follow. I admittedly got the the NBA 2K23 because I'm curious. I wanted to see what it's like because it's been so long since I played a sports game. Maybe I will stream it just so you can see how much I either freaking fall in love with it or completely detest it. Who, who knows? Might be a thing. I'd be willing to try it. I might like it. I also, I could just be utterly confused by all the stats and it could be like two hours of me going, what the fuck is this number for? And then completely sucking it on the court. Very strong possibility that. Are you pristine? <gasps> A pristine traveler's claim more. I don't know if this is true, but what a lot of people have been saying, and so far, 
it's been ringing true but you notice these shadow guys down here you can get weapons from them a lot of times when you first go in the depths the weapons that sorry i've got chocolate in my mouth the weapons that you see on these guys are just like the rusted weapons that you've been finding everywhere else in hyrule but if i understand correctly if you take like for example if i took a rusted traveler's claymore up in hyrule and without having an attach like without without uh fusing it to anything just using it till it breaks or just purposely breaking it then if once you've broken the rusty version uh above world and you come down here and find that version in the depths then you'll get the you have a chance of getting the pristine version of it but supposedly you have to break the rusted version first without having it um fused with anything so far it seems to ring true because i did go around and just literally started breaking weapons everywhere i went um i don't know if if, if you didn't understand what i said i know i explained stuff like shit. hey k-bomb how you doing uh basically find the weapon hold on where's my map find the weapon in hyrule find a rusted weapon like the traveler's claymore travelers whatever or the royal claymore or just any rusted weapon rusted spear rusted sword rusted ding dong whatever don't fuse it to anything and break it just break it like by, by slamming it on the ground doing whatever using it on enemies to break it once you've broken it supposedly these shadow guys <laughs> have a chance at having the pristine non-rusted version available if you've already broken it and that that's the, the little star thingies at the end such a relief to be here why thank you k-bomb glad you're here too anyway that's my poor explanation on the weapons theory but it seems to be working because i've been breaking weapons like crazy I've been breaking rusted weapons like crazy, and I've been finding more and more pristine weapons down here. So I will continue to do so. I will break all the rusted weapons. And supposedly it might affect the weapons that you find uh, on, on above ground or abo above the depths. You might find more pristine weapons, more pristine weapons up top. Um if you grab the pristine weapons down here i don't know again these are all rumors that i'm not sure i haven't i don't dig around all that deep but it seems to be working i mean if it works great i don't care as long as i'm getting pristine weapons and not the rusted shit what was i looking for again i was down here for a reason i was doing something over here oh yeah, i'm supposed to be going over here god damn it straight to the west which is that away. You had a long day, K bomb. The way you say it's a relief to be here. Hope your day went well. Hope you have a chance to relax. To watch me panic and scream and shit. Okay, I think that's whatever that is. Is there's a big boulder there? Plenty more bombs. Don't get off that. Off. Where's the bomb that was just here a second ago? Did they grab it. Nope. Where'd she go? You stop. Stop glowing. I'm glad you find my panic screams relaxing. Oh, I don't think I can do anything with this yet. Because I think I have to complete the Goron temple. And then once I complete the Goron temple, I think I can break these rocks. I think. Well, either complete the Goron temple. Well, yeah, no, I think I have to complete the Goron temple. So this place, I'll have to mark this for later. I'll have to remember. You know what? I will 
mark it now so I remember to go there. Okay, so that was completely pointless. What else is around here? Have I fought whatever the hell was in there? I don't know. I don't know if I can get in there. That's under... Oh, what the hell is this? That's right under Terrytown. Oh, now I'm curious. Well done. Is there a quick way down there? Is there another quick way down there? East, Akalak, whatever have you. Uh. Yeah. Welcome to. Oh, I'm just glad you have a chance to relax. I hope it helps. You got, you have uh that that was your that was your big tell that you were gonna be playing a lot of video, your kid was gonna be playing a lot of video games. You know what? I don't think I've ever played. I I never could get into Dragon Ball Z. I don't know what it was. And I love anime. But Dragon Ball Z, I couldn't get into. One Piece, I can't get into. I think part of it. Also, the animation is like really weird to me. That might be part of it. And nothing against it. I just, I just couldn't get into it. Oh, hello. Hold on. Uh, we are going to change armor. There's a big one right beneath me, and he needs to be taken care of. Needs to get spanked. We're gonna view that. I think we're good. I missed. Got it. I need to blow it up with something. No. Nope. Yup. 32 bombs. Yes, please. And my bow's gonna break. <laughs> get, get, climb them. What? Get, what are you doing? Get up there. Oh, I fought this guy before. You're nothing. Okay, I was wrong. I don't have a... Do I have a bow? Yep. Gotcha. Get up there. Get up there. Break it. the stuff oh, ah, ah, oh, oh, oh fine oh shit get off the oh you douchebag oh what why not i don't have a bow <sighs> you <Bruh. laughs> oh shit oh shit Oh shit! Oh, he blew up anyway. Oh, you're toast now, buddy. Come on! <laughs> gotcha! Oh, don't. You're gonna dump me on the red shit. No problem. Oh, hold on. Where's get over here? Need your assistance. Thank you. Those I need all the zonite. Like I use so much zonite. Ooh, 
speak with Zonai. Hello. That's a pleasant surprise. The only problem with this is it spreads everything around. I'm still chasing after it. Oh, have a good night, Jay. Thanks for coming by. Hope you had fun. Enjoy the re uh, enjoy the weekend. All right, that's almost all of it. Did I grab all of it? Grab most of it. That. And I think that's one little bit hanging over there. I'm gonna grab because why the hell not? He's not what not. Okay, where was I headed? I was headed south. I was south. Where's my? There we are. You're going that way. So how far are you on this blue? How far have you gotten? I I, I ask because I, I get curious. It's not like we can all multiplay and do this stuff at the same time. And no, I'm not, this is not a competition. Part of part of the reason is because I want to know where you're at because sometimes I don't want to give up certain certain things. Because some stuff is better if you find out for yourself. I know a lot of times I like talking about stuff and I might inadvertently say something. And I don't want to spoil certain things. There we go. Oh, Katamari Damacy. Oh my God. I used to love that game. It's such a weird game. It's an oddly satisfying game too. If you haven't played Katamari Damacy, if I'm even pronouncing it right, uh, I highly suggest you go and try it out. Uh, also, I don't promote drug use, but uh, might be one that could make it more interesting. I mean, if you try to follow the story or whatever, <laughs> it's weird. The damn, the whole damn game is like trippy as hell. Oh, you make yourself motion sick with it. I don't recall ever getting motion sick with that game unless they change something or it's a different game. What's this person I have? I'm curious. Ooh, wildflower. <gasps> oh, no, the traveler's claymore. Okay. Supposed to be heading south. But Katamari Damacy is freaking fun. Um, and if you're not familiar with it, basically what you're doing is you're controlling this little dude that's rolling a ball. And this ball that you're rolling around basically picks up anything it touches and as it picks up anything it touches it increases in mass and size and the whole point of it is you want to keep picking stuff up you want to keep growing your ball making it bigger being able to pick up bigger and bigger stuff until you're literally like the size of a planet But it's simple mechanics, but a really fun game. I see you, a little shit. Come here. Gotcha. Yeah, I can't see crap. There we go. Ooh, more bomb flowers. Oh, hell yeah. All the bomb flowers. I went to having like barely any bomb flowers. Now having a crap load. I like that. Still heading in the right direction. Don't oh, get off. Oh, 
Okay, let's grab that. Wait, she he drew his what? What game? Did I completely bypass what I was trying to run to? I completely bypassed what I was trying to run to. Eh, at least I got a root. Um, I need food. Let us eat. Eh, eat that. There. Now I gotta go north. Because I overshot. I meant to go into that little... Whatever the hell that little nook thing is. Little nook. No. Really? Ah, shit. Weird ass hills. Get up there. So what is what has everybody else been playing? I know K Bomb recently finished playing uh Life is Strange that that one I streamed. Um shit, I forgot the subtitle of that one. I streamed it I streamed it a while ago. I do like the Life is Strange games. I wish I could remember what which one that was. But she played the same one and finished that somewhat recently. Puff Troom! Look at that. The one where I got me a girlfriend, they kissed. So sweet. Okay, that's where I want to go. Ooh, That doesn't look... Will you stop flashing? Seriously? Everybody, chill! What the hell's going on? I'm trying to climb onto the robot. Come here. That was a fun game. I like. I enjoy a good story. That had a good story to it. I don't think I've been in here. Have I? You know, I probably could have checked to see if I've been in here before. I don't think I have. Is that all those tracks are from me running around Terrytown? Oh yeah, I have not been in here. What is in here? Abandoned Terry Mine. Ooh. <laughs> Okay. Okay, not a whole lot. I thought there'd be a fight, but. Possibly some loot. Yep, refinery. Oh, got a schema stone. What can I make? I can. What the hell is that supposed to be? Instant cannon? What? Instant can- Oh! Okay, I get it. It's just a stick you- uh, something you put a stick in the ground and it has two cannons attached to it. Convenient if you want to blow stuff like this up, I guess. You know what? This probably would have saved my ass had I made something like this in some of the caves that I've been in. Really? I'll be honest. I didn't think about doing something like this, and I probably should have. Because I broke so many weapons, used so many bombs, and all I needed was a cannon. That would have just done this for me. What 
Okay, you can stop now. What's in it? <gasps> chesticle. Gotta touch the chest. This is. You know how much I like to touch a good chest. <laughs> okay, bar. I mean, what? Large crystallized charge. The structure is kind of questionable looking. <laughs> Get me out of here. And there might be something on top of this. It'll look. After I touch all the other things. So I charge. A lot of pose. Just don't I charge her. Stop doing that! Seriously, lady? Just don't I charge. <laughs> Rave resist anything? I don't think so. Okay, Forge Construct. Know all about this. Met plenty of you guys. Just give me your shit. Bye bye. Why? Actually, do I have enough? No! Oh! Shit. Okay, don't have enough. Not to worry. Not worried at all. How do I get up there? Let's do this the simple, easy way. I just need... Actually, is there anything I can use to build around here? Before I do something stupid? Or... Go up this thing. That would have been the smart thing to do. <laughs> K-Bomb is up to that challenge. And say no to anything. Uh, will that reach? Ah, shit. Well, that's just poop. Okay, I was kind of hoping I was going to have an easier time with this, but... Oh, get up there! Thank you! Oh, I was kind of hoping there'd be more. Some zonite. than nothing, I guess. Then a charge. Okay, I kind of pumped out. I was kind of hoping there'd be more. Why do I have a feeling there's something neat up there? There's definitely something neat up there. All right, gonna have to do what I was thinking of doing anyway. Uh, need... Do I need one of those? And I need a rocket. Take you, put you there. Take you. And put you over eh. there. Stand on you. Nope. Hold on. Straighten you out a little bit. And drop. Nope. Don't like it. Let's see if I can. There we go. Nice and flat. Yep, we go. Perfect. Uh, don't see. Oh, there's some pose. I kind of hoping for a chest. That works, I guess. Better than nothing. All right. Investigated this. I wanted. I wanted a fight. I wanted more of a fight. Let's see. Maybe I can find another 
other arena. Or you know what I haven't done? Holy crap, why didn't I think of that? Let's see if I can do a labyrinth. Here's a Gerudo labyrinth. I've got some time, maybe, I hope. So, yeah, map would be good, thank you. I have not done a labyrinth. Oh, well, I've done a labyrinth, but I have not done another one since. So let's try that. Let's go here. Did I do the ice Gliok? I fought, I fought a few, oh, I fought the King Gliok. Uh, because there was a quest for that. Um, I actually had to take a photo of it and I fought it. The King Gliok basically has a lightning head, a fire head, and an ice head. Not, I didn't think it was any more difficult than any of the other Gliok's. It might've had a little bit more health, but otherwise it, I have a, I have a particular fighting style for Gliox that works really well for me. So it worked really well for the King Gliox as well. So I didn't find too much of a problem. And in fact, I think it might've been a little easier only because it does certain things that made it easier for me to fight it. The hardest part I think about the King Gliok was just getting to it because you have to either make a really good flying machine and have a lot of batteries or um, have a lot of stamina to glide or a combination there of, uh, of both. And I am melting. I need to wear something for the heat. Ants. Okay, so it is, of course it's behind me. I'm always facing the wrong fucking direction. We're gonna try a labyrinth. We're gonna try that labyrinth. Why the hell not? I've done one labyrinth. I've done, the labyrinth I've done before was this one. Now, was it wasn't all that bad? The labyrinths in, in Breath of the Wild were bitch, if I remember correctly. It's been a while. Yeah, the labyrinths in Breath of the Wild. I, the, the labyrinth in, that I did here, because like I said, I only did that one labyrinth. It wasn't that bad. I, I think the, the big thing was that it took a lot longer, I think. And not because of complexity, it was just long. Like I would, I would say it was almost like getting to a temple. Right. The hell was, that was that a Yiga? Oh, no, no, turn around. Want to fight Yiga? Slap him in the face. Come here. Beat you with a stick. Where do you think you're going? Gotcha. Oh, what? Well, oh, there he goes. I <laughs> uh, kind of want to just. Oh, there you are. Yeah. Got him. There's some arrows, too. All right, down we go. All right, why are there's Korok fronds, which means I'm probably going to need to use these Korok things. There's a book. Research log day one. According to Toro, the characters carved in the stone slab read as follows. The dragon ring slumbers in the labyrinth's depths. Wake it and ye shall receive due compensation. Now that Toro's gone off to examine the other ruins, I have no choice but to tough out the rest of this research alone. I'll leave a trail of acorns and nuts behind me so I don't get lost. Okay, so that's your biggest clue is you have to follow the trail of acorns and nuts. The hardest part about following the trail is sometimes they're a little hard to see. Like that, that the first the first labyrinth that I did up there. Uh, and you also have to fight the cold. 
think was was another thing with this one um you had, you had to follow uh Hy those hyrulean um uh, pine cones and as long as you followed those you were on the right path uh the i don't know if you'll get every chest by following this right path but at the very least you'll get to the end and will not get lost and then you can you can uh, like explore the labyrinth for other chests at, you know I, w I would wait till after i've completed it like right now my big thing is just completing the labyrinth and then i'll probably go around and explore the labyrinth at a later time and then you've got shit like this where you gotta find a way past that stuff but of course I've got Maneru, so that makes this easy as hell. And then a lot of times what I'll do is I'll also, you'll come across these campsites. When you come across a campsite like this, you know you're going in the right direction. I like to light the fire, just know that I've been there. Research log day two. I've researched, or I've searched each passage one by one and haven't found anything. But I've got a good feeling about this last one. The only thing keeping me from exploring it now is the late hour. I'll try to contain my excitement and get some sleep. Okay, so. Looks like he went this direction. I don't see. I'd like to say he went the. Okay, he did go this direction, but I am curious about this. Because. I have the willpower of a gnat. I do not have anything. Oh, shit. I'm going to have to do it this way. Really need more fans. That's not the button I was looking to do. That's not the button I want to do either. That's also not the button. That's the button. Stick you over. Stick you there. Give you a slap. Really? You're like right there. I just want to see if there's anything in it. Yeah. I might go back there. Don't oh, shit. Turn off. Okay, we're just going to keep following. We're just going to keep following the nuts. And because I know I'm probably going to come up against something, I'm going to put this in. Equip. Where'd my robot go? An arrow. Come here. Follow the nuts. I'm oh, having a good night, Simon. Thanks for coming by. Okay, did he go? I don't see any nuts over there. Show me your nuts. Oh shit. Okay, this could be a problem. Not seeing nuts. And I'm feeling cold, which is not good also. Oh, there's a nut. <laughs> Shit. I really hate this weather thing. All right. Uh, ooh, more nuts. All the nuts. Where's your nuts? Okay, shit. I might have to... <sighs> yeah, I'll... Yeah, I don't want to have to break it, but I have to. Destroy that. Oh, equip that. And we are going to attach... I should have... Damn it. Should have some fronds in my inventory, but why do I not see any? Oh, there they are. There we go. So I don't have to keep ta Oh, hello. So I don't have to keep taking a fan out. Mighty Zone I Sword, which I can't carry. God damn it. <coughs> uh, shit. Let's 
get rid of this. Alright. Give me your seed. That's a shroom. seed. I'm on the right track. Wait, I was just taking a fucking shortcut. Grab that. Grab that. Another seed. Let's see if there's any chests over here. Oh. Got a, well, can't carry the bow. Let's grab this seed. Grab that seed. Go up here. Oh, campsite. Nice. I'm on the right track. No fire delight, though. Yeah, inventory management is coming to haunt me. Research log day three. No matter how far I go or which way I turn, everything looks the same. It's all covered in... And I freaking click too fast. I've somehow managed to swallow my overwhelming desire to run home and will attempt to spend the night here. I just hope I have enough acorns to mark my way to that. Okay, so I'm taking that as a clue that I need to follow only the acorns. So there might be other nuts, but I just want to touch the acorns. I don't want to touch the other nuts, just the acorns. I'm guessing that's... Okay, see, there's an acorn. We'll fondle that one. Another acorn. I fell. Is that an acorn? That is not an acorn. So I'm wondering... I don't want to go that way. God damn it. I'm going to check out what's over here first. Because, oh, well, hold on. Pretty sure that's not an acorn. I don't want to go there. Yeah, that's a chickaloo tree. Nut. So I'm going to go this way in hopes that I find an acorn. Strong zone ain't long, so god damn it. Inventory management kicking my ass. Okay, well, this can go. Which is sad because this is the push, the puff shroom spear. That this weapon is actually freaking great when you're fighting a whole bunch of mobs. But uh, I sadly have to get rid of it. Because I don't have room. It's one of those, um, one of the weapons, the woodland weapons or wood weapons or whatever, because the, normally those puff shrooms spear, the, the puff shrooms are like one hit. You, you attach them to a weapon, use the weapon once and the, the puff shroom disappears. But on those wooden weapons, the puff shroom stays. You can use it repeatedly, which is awesome. Especially when you're fighting mobs, because then you can just keep uh, using it over and over again and everybody gets confused. Okay, here we go. This is good. Campsite. Let's light this up. I don't know if any of you guys are understanding a word I'm saying, but I'm trying my best. Research log, day four. I can't believe I'm writing this, but I'm standing in front of ancient Zonai ruins. What a tremendous discovery. This makes the terror and uncertainty of getting here completely worth it. It's just a shame for me that I have no idea what these ruins are, but I'll head back and report to people who might. Okay, so is this it? Uh, <laughs> I don't want to fuck this up. <laughs> I'm saving.
Let's hope I'm in the right path. There is... Oh, hello. I am on the right path. Nice. Oh, and these labyrinths, unlike Breath of the Wild, are multi-level. Just so you know. Let's take care of this shrine. You don't have to take care of the shrine, I don't think. Or do you? Maybe you do. I do them anyway. Sometimes I feel like a nut. Who am I kidding all the time? Ooh. Large sonite charge. And another shrine done. We'll just skip all this. I have enough for another heart. All right, so we've completed this part of the labyrinth. Now, let's see what I'm talking about. Go on to the next part. For you who conquered this labyrinth of the land, I, the ruler of boars, have unlocked a door. Find it on the north side of the labyrinth of the sky. Okay, so entrance is on the north side of the Sky Labyrinth, and then... Uh... Okay, how the fuck do we get out of here? I could just probably port over, but... Usually there's an exit. And I'm kind of curious. I want to see if I pop up through here if there's anything neat. Okay, I was right. This leads straight to the exit. Was there a cooking pot here? I think there was. I probably could cook something. Or maybe not. Shit, I thought there was one. Oopy. Okay, well, up we go. Let's see, what's closest to... That one. Actually, before I do that, what's over here? Beam emitters, sleds, mirrors, steering sticks, and stakes. I grab a bunch of those. All right. Uh, it, was, it was good to play with my brother again. We don't get that opportunity often because, uh, usually because of scheduling. He's a pretty busy guy, not to mention with his kids. Uh, it, it's really hard to get, get together unless it's like really late. And, uh, I was admittedly kind of sacrificing my time because I had to be up early a few times. Uh, but uh, I'll lose a little sleep for a, for a chance to play a few with my brother. That. Grabbed. Yep. So I charge. Okay. So. The labyrinth was, yeah. Oh wait, I wanted to check this machine out real quick. What was over here again? Beam emitters, sleds, mirror, steering sticks. And, eh, I can do a few of those. Why the hell not? Let's. Yeah, how many of these do I have? Eh, I got enough. Woohoo! 
I like the sleds. The sleds are fun. All the things. Actually, I should probably get more bombs when I find a Zonite device that'll get me bombs. Should do that later. Okay, so the labyrinth is straight to the south of me. So let's point this sucker to the south. It's already almost there. Ah! Wait, is it that thing? Yeah, it's gotta be that thing. It's kind of pointed that direction already. Uh... I'm aiming this right. I could also probably just fly a machine over there, but fuck it. Let's change my armor. I'm starting to get stingy with my shit. Once I start, once I know I start go, getting near end game, or start planning towards doing end game stuff, I start hoarding. My my tendency to hoard multiplies. Yeah, you're cold. I know. Deal with it. Off we go. Oh shit! I really hope I can. <laughs> Fuck! I hope I can make it. That looks a lot farther than I thought it was gonna be. That is a lot farther than I thought it was gonna be. Maybe I should have machined it. Oh, that doesn't help. Oh, you missed me. I mean, I can always try it again. S seriously? Ow! Asshole! That one hit me. Oh, fuck. That one also dropped me in good, decent ways. I might have to go back and flying machine this thing. I don't think I've got... Ah, shit. Yeah, I'm not gonna make it. That fucking bird. <coughs> I have to make the cycle. I was hoping I could just glide over to it and I'd be fine. But taking that hit definitely didn't help. I know I've got more than enough juice to fly over there with a flying machine. So let's, uh, where is it? That, that, that. and let's make that. Away we go. And hopefully we can avoid getting freaking slapped around by that stupid bird thing. Oh yeah, definitely worth it, Mia. Although the only thing is I I some of our some of our tastes in games um have diverged. You're an asshole. Fucking bird thing. Go away. Oh, fuck off. Okay. I might have made it away from him. Oh, nope. There he comes. You shit. So I'm going to shoot the fuck out of you later. I lost him. I don't know if there was another way up here, but. Oh, up, 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 up. Okay, there we go. Now just, yep. Hey, made it. Grab the shrine. See what this one's all about. A 
I need more moss. Oh, good. Easy one. Probably should have grabbed that heart. Ooh. Really don't see too many shrines that have fruit like that around in them. I'll happily take that. Mighty construct bow that I cannot use or cannot hold. I will save you for later. I'll just have to remember that I never got the freaking weapon from here. Which I'll probably for What the frick? Really? Okay, maybe we'll grab that bow. Um. Uh, nah. How was this shit? What? What happened here? Why is this? Wait a second. Why does this look like it's not lit? Okay, lit. That do anything? Oh, let's light that one, maybe? Oh! <laughs> okay, then. Cool. No, whoa! Oh, it even, they even gave me arrows. Okay, hold on. I have a feeling I'm just gonna... Yep. Woohoo! That was weird. Never seen this before. Alrighty then. Still gotcha. I swear, playing playing Breath of the Wild and playing uh Tears of the Kingdom has really got me more perceptive of certain patterns. Like the missing lights, for example. Took me a minute, but immediately was just, yeah, something didn't seem right. Okay, so I can unlock this. To you who set foot in my labyrinth of the sky, I offer a test of wisdom. Four terminals are hidden in this maze. Activate them all. Okay, so this isn't very different from the last one that I did. Now this one is going to require a good amount of minimap use. Actually, Adventure Log gives me a little idea of where they might be. Oh. Woo! Ah, uh, uh, really? Get off! Get off the wall! Seriously, let go! Let go! There we go! Shit! No, fall, fall. Oh, wait, just go over that. Or I could have gone over that, but I'm a dumbass. Okay, so looking for the terminals. Say one was around here somewhere. Is that one of them? That's one of them. Yep, found one. I probably should change my outfit. Wrong button. Uh, 
I'm telling you, if you guys can get the glider outfit, this freaking outfit handy is freaking all get out. Okay, so I did that. What happens if I just go up from here? Huh. That boosts me up. Oh. The only thing you have to be wary of during these labyrinths is your stamina use. chest can't carry your ass i have too much shit oh uh, this way oh yep there's another one in there figure out how to get inside inside uh top maybe i don't think i can get up from below yep That was my crotch. <laughs> uh, fuck. Gotta be a way up there that I'm not seeing. Maybe we'll grab that one later. Let's try one of these other ones. At least I know where that's at. Another chest. Can't carry that either. Is this confusing your brain? <laughs> uh, actually, I think this is the one I was just trying to get into. The one I was just trying to get it. Oh wait! Found it. Okay. That leaves two more. Which ones did I get? Show, does it show me on the map? Okay, two more. More to go. The funny thing is I'm using the mini map in the lower right corner more to navigate and move than anything else right now. Like I'm, I'm not really watching myself so much, so much as watching me move around this, my, watching my arrow move around the mini map. I only start looking at where I'm flying when I come across an obstacle that I need to navigate through. Let's land. My bearings here. Whoop. 
Shit. Okay, I'm missing something. Okay. Other freaking side. Well, they do call it a labyrinth for a reason. And it is a maze. I need to get to this outer rig. That's a help. Here. Here. Where's the entrance to this one? There you are. Okay, got one more. Oh, wait, hold on. I'll be right back. I hear a cat meowing. Be right back. Ever since I got that outdoor cage that I have on the balcony for Obi, he spends nearly his entire day out there now sitting in the cage and relaxing out, out in the fresh air. And then he me <laughs> he'll eventually meow at night to be let back in. But he seems to love his cage. Like I'll, I'll open the door. He'll, he'll waltz right in there and then start chilling in his cage. Hello and then there. when he wants back in. Come right back. Or it starts meowing to get let back in for whatever reason. <sighs> okay, so where was I? Oh, yeah. I, wait, I just got that one. Okay. So got that one. I've got one left and that's going to be pretty sure there. Adventure logs. Yep. I think that's the one I had trouble figuring out. Uh, let's I'm gonna try something. Oh wait, no, if I go too low, I just realized if I go too low, I'm not going back up. So let's this way. Trying to figure out how I'm going to get to the last terminal. And then down here. Over here. And that's a freaking dead end. This way. That 
way. I'm going the right direction. Should be in this quadrant somewhere. Ah, shit. I overshot it. I overshot. Let's go back. Is that another chest? Is. Anything I can keep? Like bombs? Or arrows? Or a Zonite shield I can't use. Well, I'm coming back to this freaking labyrinth later to stock up if I ever lose any of my shit. I wonder, can I just climb this freaking wall? God damn it. In here. This way. In here. Okay, rest my laurels a little bit. Let's see. This is the one I had trouble figuring out how to get inside. There's that chest. Yeah, okay, it's right there, but I didn't see how to get in here. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Maybe I can climb? Oh, that's way too high. There's gotta be a way. Up here, maybe I can climb. Damn it. Turn yourself around so you can climb the wall. Why? Fucking freezing again. God damn it. Stupid weather. Stop it. Shit, how the hell do we get in here? Maybe it has to do with this chest? Oh! Fucking hell! Where the hell did I go? How did I, how the fuck did I even get in here? Maybe it was I don't know. You know what? I'm here now. Fuck it. God damn it! Out of my way, everybody! I'm trying to touch the thingy. Oh, I'd definitely say hi to everyone, guys. Or for Obi. Thank you. Uh, I'm trying to give him as comfortable. I'm trying to keep him as comfortable as he can be. He's enjoying the outdoors. Let him enjoy the outdoors. He's getting, like I said, he's getting old. Really? All the way up. Thank you. chest grab that first like I said he's getting old uh I know he's probably suffering from dementia of some sort he's an ancient cat big battery finally a chest I can take something out of and keep Here we go. Let's hit this. Really? You who have traversed this maze, mark well my words. I have pulled apart the bars in the labyrinth of the land that obstructed your path below ground.
From high above to far below, prove your courage by diving into the depths of the earth. The final way shall open to you. Woohoo! <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. All right, I'm going to do a quick save. Oh, and before you forget, I know I'm going to freeze a little bit, but fuck it. I'm changing my armor. In case I fall on something. No! Oh, wrong button. Whee! Straight down. Oh, sure. There's a shooting star here. Seriously? Come back here. Gotcha. Oh my god. <laughs> Made it in the hole. And what are you? Uh fire that. Fire that. Fire that. And oh, okay. Oh, there's one of you below me. Okay. Uh, I don't know which way I'm going. Hello? Oh, there you are. Shh. I'll pop him in the face. I might want a weapon other than a freaking fan. Um, let's use that. Because why the hell not? And let's blow him the fuck. Oh, you know what? How many of those bones do I have? The bones. How are you doing? And again. And okay, bye. <laughs> Your feet are mine. Those away. Take that away. Ha <laughs> ha. Take the other hand away. Get the foot away. Take that foot or, or not. <laughs> no slam for you. Take that foot away. You fall apart. You're putting my hands. You've got nothing on me. I know all your tricks. You are nothing. Not even a Lego. Oh, trying to get fancy on me, are you? Well, I got a lot of bombs again. Eat a dick. That frightens me. They like them apples. Nope. Plenty of bombs. Nothing. I don't care. Toast. Woohoo! Nice. Yeah, all the things. Ooh, what am I going to stick this on? Uh. Mighty Zonite Sword, Strong Zonite Long Sword. We'll stick you on this thing. Nice. 
Well, let's complete this baby. See what, see what I get. Actually, I think I get another piece of armor. I like to say is the demon armor. You who have traversed this labyrinth of the depths. This trial was a test of your talents. In overcoming it, you have shown yourself to be strong of body, skill, and mind. In my name as the ruler of Boars, I commend your achievement and offer you a fitting reward. Armor wreathed in otherworldly evil, hidden away since days of old. Take it now. Just take it. Take it! Evil spirit mask. Nice. So they are evil. The evil set. That's what I got. Some believe this eerie mask is inspired by a malevolent entity. It's a rather rare find. I've got... What, what parts do I have of it? I should have two. Where is it? The evil spirit mask. And the greaves. So all I'm missing now is the chest. Sweet. And ooh, okay, never been around here before. Is there an exit? I want to see if there's a uh There's a light route nearby here. That I can take advantage of. Because I know there's a lot of stuff around here that I want to be able to grab. Oh, yep, there's an exit. There's been a lot of uh, chess and whatnot I couldn't pick up. On a pose. So if I can grab me a light route, that'll make things very, very easy. Uh. Nope. 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 think that might be one I haven't hit yet. Yeah, see, I'm down to 42 arrows now. <laughs> oh, shit, that's a long way down. Any other light routes closer? There might be. Let's make sure I don't already have that light route. Facing that. I might already have that light route. Shit. Oh, yeah, you were talking about arrows, Mia. <laughs> and see, I'm already down to 42. Actually, I'm going to be down to 41 in a second. Oh, wait a second. Is that, uh... What is that? It's nothing. I'm hoping there'd be a closer light route. Shit. Yep. That's fire one there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Somebody kill those things. Where the hell did that light route go? Or I mean, that arrow go? Jeez, I didn't light up anything. You. Yeah, there's got to be a light route near here. Hold on. Wait a second. Oh, that was the labyrinth, so that might not freaking count. Okay, so there should be a light route right here, and there should be a light route right there. So I'm closest to this one right now. So just north, northeast. Oh, one interesting thing I found out also is the depth is almost a complete reverse of the land above like mountains uh, up in Hyrule or the land above are like deep crevasses here in the depths why did I freaking do that that was 
up. So that one, that one uh, light route that I'm um, heading to, like on the map, is like on top of a uh, kind of smallish mountain, which means down in the depths, the light route is probably going to be in a like a pit of sorts or crevasse. Yeah, it's it's, a, it's like a it's really a mirror of the overworld. It took a while for that to fucking sink in. I mean, the shrines were one giveaway. Yep, 36 arrows. No, 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 no. Which means, where the hell is that mic? There you are. Shine bright like a diamond. I'm not sure what that, that didn't really seem to reveal a whole lot. I've got what looks like I'm another Yiga base, I'm guessing. And what could be a mine with another piece of armor. And I like the thought of that. So let's make this quicker. Because I'm all about grabbing bits of armor. And the Yiga base, if that's what I think it is, it looks like it'd be a Yiga base. And if it is, that would also mean another schematic. Let's make one of these. I am fine with another bit of armor and another schematic. Not that any of the schematic I mean some of them is some of the schematics are like makes me wonder why they decided to make that as you know like a a hidden schematic or something. Like that's like some of them are just like that's like the dumbest idea I've ever seen. And then others actually I've built upon because like it was a good yeah, that's a Yiga base. Which means you will have to die. So let's do this. Let's do that. That's the fucking shit. God damn it. No, no. Oh, don't tell me my freaking pro controllers being douchey. I don't want it to be douchey. These things are expensive. Ah! <laughs> oh, it all landed in the poop. Grabbing it anyway. Okay, where are you? Oh, wait, did this guy make a bike? Look at that. Why did I think of that? He's even got titty lights. Oh, I've got some planning. I've got some building to do. Okay, this guy needs to go away. God damn it. Bye. That unlocks the door. And now I just got to get my ass up there. I, wait, I've got a flying machine. Where the fuck's my flying machine? And whoa, shit. There we go. Up. 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 Turn. turn I'm, shit. Up, okay. To the, to the left. Ah, fuck it. No, what the fuck? Just got stuck on the shit. God damn it. I got stuck on the fucking handlebars. Billy. Wrong button. 
I got stuck in the fucking handlebars. I'm about to leap off and then freaking glide back down. Damn it. It would have looked really cool, but I get stuck on the stupid machine. Let's try that again. Seriously? Okay, we're going to fly this way. We're going to fly in towards it a little bit. There we go. Ow. Yeah, still I landed. That should be a schematic. Yep. Hey, what is it? Oh, the motorcycle. Cool. Okay. Well, now I don't have to worry about trying to put that together. That thing I was looking at down there that the guy was writing. And a large crystallized charge. Awesome. And was there anything else? Bananas. Sundalions. Safety first. Transportation constructed from Zonai devices is convenient. Your precautions must be followed. Familiarizing yourself with the following guidelines will reduce the two most common causes of fatalities. One, keep your balance to avoid overturning the vehicle. If the vehicle is off balance, evacuate immediately. Two, protect the driver from all attacks. Even a simple arrow can threaten their ability to steer. <laughs> Glory to Master Koga. Breaking all your shit. Whoops. Well. Oh, wait, did I want to be using this weapon? 52? I'm fucking saving that. Uh. You. Oh, wait. You. Ah, you. All right. Oh, this is gonna break. Ten more arrows. Actually. Nice. Uh, any more boxes I can break? Here we go. Oh, I see an arrow! It's in the shit! Is that ever? Oh, nope. Hold on. Almost forgot to grab these guys. Okay, I think we're good here. Let's see. So, that was a Yiga camp. That looks like it might have some treasures. So, where the hell did I put my... Oh, crap. My chopper's up there, isn't it? Yep. Oh, wait a second. Is there an exit to... Uh, I need to go east. Are these doors open up or anything? Bananas. More arrows. I don't see a gate. Where's the... Oh, the gate's right there. No, that's not a gate. The fuck's the gate? Like, how the fuck do you guys get out? Seriously. Oh, more boxes. Damn it. fuck do you guys get out of here I was planning on riding the motorcycle out but I guess not <laughs> I can ride this now I needed to go which direction the other direction There are, there's a freaking flower attached to my wheel. Not the fastest thing in the world. I need to get to that. 
At least this thing's stable. I don't know how well it's going to take a fall. I guess we'll find out. Need to go down that way. Canyon mine. Okay. So far, so good. Everything's fine. Oh, never mind. We got stuck. Or not. Or yes, we did. Okay, this is fine. I only needed it to take me here anyway. So let's off that. And usually there's a chest in one of the, in these mines. So building up here let's get up here and i think a lot of times you'll find a map that's going to lead you in this direction but uh don't need a map if you're just roaming around large crystallized charge not gonna argue i was kind of hoping for like armor though and a lot of zonite, which I will have to collect because he needs it. Can just the time bombs for these? I don't know if that did a whole lot. The only problem. With using the time bombs, and since they don't explode on contact, getting some of these higher bits would be a pain. I go through zonite so fast building stuff especially when I'm experimenting because a lot of times I'll try to experiment and make like large builds and some stuff that I've tried to make ended up costing like a hundred zonite or a hundred something zonite or just some ridiculous amount at the same time I am trying to build stuff that are just like Stupidly large for shits and giggles. Uh. Wait, what do you got for me? What kind of cool weapon do you have? Soldier's broadsword. Eh, sure, why not? Christine. Or zone I, I can grab from here. Probably a lot, but I'm not going to try to grab everything. Maybe next time. That's about it. Okay, so that takes care of two uh, labyrinths now. Still would have liked to find another... Uh, would have loved to find another... Um, whatchamacallit arena I mean there's got to be a couple more arenas around here somewhere just not sure where I mean I've still got a lot to go and uh uncover 
I wonder, oh, I wonder if the bosses are back. I got to take a look. Curious to see if the bosses come, if the, yeah, if the bosses come back after, uh, after Blood Moon. To my east. Which is that way. Oh, yep. They're back. Do I want to fight you? I mean, I could. I've actually got some arrows now. <laughs> I mean, I don't need to fight it because I fought it before. There was a chest down there. It's gone now because I've got it. At the same time, I'm thinking I can use its parts. I mean, they do make decent uh, stuff to stick to weapons. So this one's just kind of a pain. Ah, oh, fuck it. Why not? For the stream. I probably missed. I so I missed so hard. Oh yeah, that's that sucked a cock. I'm not gonna miss this time. Or yeah, I am. <laughs> Who am I kidding? No, I don't need air. I fought this thing without arrows before. Like, I literally ran out of arrows. Ow, oh, shit. I really cannot gauge distance. Where are you going? Oh, fine. Wait, am I wearing... What am I wearing? Okay, I got all my glide gear up. You. Gotcha. Eh. Gotcha again. Yeah, you can you can definitely rematch the bosses. In fact, when you first when you first find them in the depths, they they are guarding a chest. So you'll want to fight them at least once, you know, each one at least once again, especially if you want the chest. Why still short? God damn it. Got it. Yeah, my bow broke. Uh, do I want to use a Lionel bow for shits and giggles? Yeah, what the hell? Why not? It'll make this. It'll make this level a lot faster. I'm gonna shoot your butt. That's still too. Nope, got it. Oh, whoa, 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 no, no, where are you going? Ah, fuck it. Asshole. Wait, what happened to Mia's message? She went, oh, 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 oh. oh shit. Here. Gotcha. here. I ain't done with you. <laughs> Wait, 
Wait. <laughs> what did Mia say? What? Ah. <sighs> and I've got. Really? Is that it? One? Seriously? Just one? Okay, I'm gonna stick it on my. On, on my Nera. Hold on. Come here. You. Got you a new weapon. Let's attach you to the right. Yeah. Nice. That doesn't look menacing. <laughs> And I think there's another one, same caldera. I think this is another caldera. And uh, I'm pretty sure there was there was a couple of the moth gibdos or the, the, the queen gibdos. So I fought those two. There'll probably be more other stuff around here as well. But um, yeah, you can refight at least those two bosses. I don't know. I obviously haven't done the others. So I don't know if you'll be able to refight those. It's a possibility. Definite possibility. But yeah, you can redo those. I like to redo them because A, they're fun. B, I can give it to Monera as a cool little weapon. And I'm seriously, that looks menacing as hell on the bot. I'm not going to lie. Um... In fact, if I fought the other one, probably get two, put them on both arms. That'd be awesome. All right, let's... I need... <laughs> I'm running out of arrows again. So we're going to head back. And, uh... Yeah, I just noticed it's also midnight, so I think, yeah, I'm just going to head back. I'm going to probably refill on some arrows and bombs, but other than that, I think that's going to be it for tonight. Had some fun showing some stuff, finding some stuff. Oh, uh, the labyrinth was cool. Hope you guys learned a bit on the labyrinth. But, uh, yeah, that'll be it, I think. And then tomorrow, uh, hopefully we'll have some uh, co-op time with Caboose. Maybe... We might even do uh co-op with uh caboose crimson struggles throughout the week and i know i know crimson mentioned she really missed doing some co-op so who knows it could be a full a full weekend of it at the very least we'll be seeing them on sunday because i know she's been wanting to play again um but hopefully we'll get some co-op going this weekend with the with a group with the original group and uh i don't know we'll see what we can play it's been a while since we did any anything spoopy so maybe we'll do something spooky. Because I, I kind of miss it. And, uh, oh, I, I was coming here so I can buy shit. A freaking. God. So, hope you enjoyed. I know I had fun tonight. It was nice. It was relaxing. And I'm glad to spend some time with you guys. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you enjoyed spending some time with me. Um, if you liked what you saw, please drop a like down below. And if you haven't yet, hit subscribe, hit the notification bell. And also don't forget to check out my Discord and my Patreon. Links in description below. Thank you so much for being here with me. Always awesome with you guys. Always love chatting with you guys. Special thanks to my patrons as well. Thank you so much for your support. You have no idea what it means to me. Thank you everybody for your support, whether you're a patron or not. And uh, that's gonna be it. Give me those. Thank you. So, hope to see you tomorrow night. Have a good night. And bye-bye. Hey, kid. Don't ever let them get inside your head. They'll tell you what to do in life instead. Of everything you know that you can get. Let them guide your life towards regret I'll fight for what I love with every breath My past is filled with things I won't forget I use them all to push me to my best So treat the worst of times just like a test 
If only I could go back in time I'd tell myself that everything will end up alright Just push yourself, test yourself, figure out what you like and Find your limits, don't be rigid, always work towards a prime Surround yourself with open minds, people can change your life A few friends with intent can help you feel alive Find a passion, take some action, and with a little time Just be patient, make a statement, try to enjoy your life They'll try to kick you while you're down they wanna rise up while you drown They wanna fill your head with doubt They're silently scared that you'll figure it out I'll make it look like I'm losing Won't bother hiding my bruises And when they finally think you're wounded Then it's your chance to be ruthless Ooh. 